welcome to another episode of Hump Day with Hayley. It's Wednesday and here is another treat for you all. I'm going to do things a bit different this time because I'm going to be starting off with the beauty segment and then we're going to move on to the chit chat. I just thought I'd mix things up a bit, that's the only reason why. And I have got a few different beauty type things to show you. The first comes in the form of a hairbrush. So I've posted about this before on my Instagram and it's by Hair Shark. And this is what it looks like. And it's actually like a back coma. And what it does is you've got one side with kind of like um, bristles and then almost like, um, like plasticky type, I wouldn't say like a comb, but kind of, you, you get, do you know what I mean? That sort of thing. Um, and then you've got obviously the bristles and then the other side you have, um, that th it's just plastic here, like plastic teeth almost. And that is what um, smooths down your hair once you've back combed it. So I'm gonna just show you quickly now. So I tend to just pull my, let me take this coat off because that's gonna get really aggravating. It's a bit nippy today, so hence why. I have my court on. Okay, so you want to take a section and then what you're going to do is with the bristle side, that's what you back comb with. And the thing is you can do as much or as little as you want. Like if you don't want like really big, big hair, don't, it's fine. Like you're in control. It's in your hands and you can also Use it as a microphone as you're getting ready. Because <laughs> we all do that. Come on, let's stop pretending. Um, and literally just take sections. I mean, it would help if I was a hairdresser. I'm not. But this just shows you how easy it actually is. And it won't damage your hair either. So don't think like, oh no, look, that's going to be really wrecking her hair. Um... I mean, my hair's actually in quite good nick now for the first time in forever, thanks to my darling Kazzy. Okay, so once you're happy with the volume that you've got, again, you can make it as big as you like. If you want to go like full on Amy Winehouse, you can with this. Or you can have it kind of just a little bit. It's totally up to you. And then you're going to flip it. And on this side, which is like the teeth bit, um you can then just go over the top and it just smooths it down. So you don't obviously have, you know, when you back comb, it goes a bit like fluffy almost. And that then just smooths it like so. And that is that. I mean, if you want to pin it, you can pin it at the back. I'm not going to today. I'm just going to leave it like this, but that is what I wanted to show you today. It's by Hair Shark and it is fabulous. I do enjoy using it and it I think it does give a really good effect. Like, you know, once it's done and I haven't, since I've been using this, I haven't bothered with hairspray or anything like that. Um, I'm trying to avoid putting too much chemical and product in my hair. So this is brilliant. There you go, that is what it looks like. And again, it's by Hair Shark. I'll leave the links in the description box below. Let me just put my um, shawl back on. It's not actually a shawl, it's like a little fair cardigan thing, but um, it's a bit chilly in my house. And I'm just like, don't put the heating on. Just don't do it, Hayley. For the love of God, don't do it. So I'm just keeping warm this way. My next beauty buy is this. It is a cleanser and it's by Eve Lom. This is what it looks like. Can you guys see that? I feel like these lights are too bright. There you go, that's what it looks like. And um, the consistency of this cleanser, it's kind of almost like quite um, waxy, like a bit like um, Vaseline, but you rub it into your hands, which softens it, and you also get a muslin cloth with this. This is brilliant. I use this religiously in the winter especially. I find that um, it makes my skin feel less dry. Like I get quite dry skin in the winter. Um, I think because I end up with the 
car fans like literally just blasting my face as I'm driving because I can't bear feeling too cold so I end up with like the heating on and I think that maybe dries my skin out I don't know but this is brilliant I will leave the links below like I said um and I just use this of an evening I don't bother in the morning so much but at night time I use the Eve Lom cleanser in the autumn slash winter months the last thing is more for um the guys of the universe if you've got a guy in your life if you're a guy watching this Hello, we are so happy to have you here. Um, it's this, it is a um, aftershave and it's by um, m and and Marks and Spencers. Who knew? I was in there the other day and um, I could smell like a really nice smell. Do you ever get that? Just, I'm completely gonna go off topic now because that's what I like to do. Um, do you ever get that where you walk through like a store and if you you sense a smell coming from somewhere, you have to like a nice smell, not a like gross one, a nice smell. You have to like kind of seek out where that's coming from. Anyway, that's what happened to me. I was in Marks and Spencers and I could smell something really nice. And I was like, where's that? So um, I then started kind of like searching around for it like some sort of hunting dog and um, <laughs> what are they called like bloodhounds that's what I became I was like <laughs> and then I found this oh my god it's amazing I got it for my husband and um, it looks like this it's called ho hom homie 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 hom <laughs> and the bottle was quite nice as well but it was like 18 pounds which I thought was amazing and it lasts all day long like my husband will obviously like spray this on before he goes into the office and um he comes home and I'm still like oh you smell an absolute dream you smell delightful so I wanted to show you guys this just um because obviously Christmas is fast approaching Oh, nobody panic. And really nobody panic because coming up on Hunt Day with Hayley, I have got some magnificent stuff to show you in terms of Christmas buys. So seriously, don't panic. It's fine. I'm going to take care of it. And also I'm going to be doing on my Sundays, some organising before Christmas, just for an added bit of help. If you need it. If you don't, it's fine. Just watch anyway for the fun of it. Um... And yeah, so this is brilliant. I think if you want to get a gift for someone or um, you want to buy it for yourself, I think £18 is an absolute steal. And like I said, it does last all day long. So that is the end of the beauty segment. Let's now move on to what's been going on this week. <laughs> So it obviously was um, the royal wedding last week Friday, loved it, watched it, brilliant, couldn't quite work out why Camilla wasn't there, I mean allegedly she had other um, engagements, like she was going on like a hunt or something, or I, I don't know what, I might have just made that up, it might not have been a hunt, but I think she was doing, she had something on in Scotland I believe, um, but I was a bit like, that really amused me because it was like, I'm just not coming. I've got other engagements, so I mean, just go and get married and let's not make a fuss. <laughs> so that was fun. And um, yeah, I loved it. I loved her dress. I loved her evening dress. I think she looked amazing. I loved everything the guests were wearing. Cara Delevingne was a um, just a delight of you I was like I love the fact that you've gone like super edgy and worn like a top hat and a tux you go girl loved it so that was that and then obviously um the news came that Meghan Markle was pregnant and um it was quite funny actually because I was laying in bed last night with my husband and I was like I forgot to tell him stupid me right literally thinking he's even gonna be bothered and I was like oh my god babe guess what and he was like what and I was like you know Meghan Markle she's pregnant 
And he was like, oh, nice, I'll get him a card, babe. And I was like, what is your problem? Like, I'm just trying to share some news with you. He literally was like, I couldn't care less. <laughs> Which is quite funny, because to be fair, I mean, does it impact our lives? I mean, it's lovely, and I think they are like couple goals. The way she looks at him, she's like, I've been dreaming of a true love's kiss. <laughs> it's so sweet. Um, but yeah, so that was my week really, in a ball. Um, let me know in the comments below, guys, whether you watched the wedding, what you thought, your feelings. Do you love the royals? Do you loathe the royals? Either way, it's fine. You're entitled to your opinion. I mean, I'm not like a huge royalist by any stretch of the imagination. I mainly watch these things purely just because I like to see what outfits people are wearing. And I mean, with the exception of Harry and Meghan, I do like them quite a lot because I just think, I don't know, I just think she seems really sweet. But let me know in the comments below your thoughts are let me know how your week's been let me know what you've been up to and also i want to hear from anyone who has started their christmas shopping if you started your christmas shopping because i want to use this in an upcoming vlog let me know in the comments below um as long as you're happy for your comment to be featured across the youtube Haley's help channel right here um then write in the comments below if you started your christmas shopping you might even be finished and if you are, keep fighting the good fight because that is, I mean, I don't know how people do it. Like, there are people out there, I know there are, who have already done their Christmas shopping now and are like, yeah, mine's wrapped, done, it's in the loft space, you know, I've got a tree that I'm going to be pulling out <laughs> and it will just inflate itself. If you're that person, comment below. Anyway, I shall see you all again next time on Hump Day with Hayley. That will be next week, Wednesday. My homemaking vlogs will continue on the Sunday. And for those of you who haven't installed it yet or are going to be installing it, I'm just going to give you a Hayley's help heads up now. Um, the iPhone um, update has given like a new thing where they um, shame you into how much time you're spending on um, social media. So I'm just letting you know now. I mean, my time on there has been okay so far, but um, I mean, who knows where this is going to go. It's at 53 minutes currently, so we'll see. But I just feel like I need to let you all know, if you haven't already done the update, that's what you've got to look forward to. It will let you know on your phone, you know, that you are essentially addicted to social media. So have fun with that. And I'll see you all again next time. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel if you haven't done so already. Don't forget to like this video and also click the bell so you can get notifications for when I will be back on. Adios amigos.